hey what's up guys welcome back you are watching for take last time on the 5th of the march i gave you the update video for the awaken os one plus 6 and 60. that rom was pretty solid but still some users reported that the mic issue in the audio calls so the vikasaka optimus and all the awaken os dev team has released the new update on 15th march visually you will not see any difference in the rom but when you use it it actually makes the difference in the users than the previous rom as this ROM is now encrypted by the default, you need to clean flash the ROM. So without wasting your time, let's get started for the installation and the review. On the new adventure. As you can see the last time I was on the Evolution X Android 12 L ROM, I will now start the flashing of Awaken OS. So first download the Awaken OS zip file and the finalized zip. Now go to the security setting and remove all the pins and the passwords. Now boot to the TWRP by long pressing the volume down plus power button. TWRP 3.6 is recommended. After booting to the TWRP first flash the ROM zip file. After flashing gets completed again tap the install and select the finalized zip file. In the flashing process don't flash the TM variety because ROM is encrypted and the encryption will work for the TWRP also. Now go to the advanced and tap flash current TWRP or flash TWRP installer zip file and reboot back to the TWRP. Now tap wipe, select the format data and type yes. If you get the error then go to the settings and check mark the RFRM option and then format the data. Now it should work. Then tap reboot to the system. After completing the setup if it goes to about phone we can see still we are on the Android 12 build. It's not upgraded to Android 12.1 as the Evolution X ROM has already upgraded. But soon we'll get the update for that. This is the Awaken OS version Aura 2.4. Security patch is still old Fit 2022. So the major change in this build is the shifting to the 4.9.227 Primus kernel, which has the big improvement in the performance. This is the build created on 15th March 2022. So let's take the look of the performance of the ROM after changing kernel and also lots of the underwood performance patches has been added in the ROM. So after taking the Geekbench test, I am totally surprised. This test given me the highest results of the Geekbench till the date in all Android 12 custom ROMs. I got 509 for the single core and 2252 in the multi core. These results also beats all the average results of OnePlus 6 on the Geekbench. Also, it's higher than the OnePlus 60 also in the race of the Geekbench test results. These results are just not restricted to the numbers. They also apply in the day-to-day -day performance. Everything is super smooth and just gliding on the fingers. Next major thing in the update is the fixing the mic issue. The mic was not working properly when we were on the normal or the VOP calls on the previous builds. I used ran the app from the Play Store to check the mic is working or not and how it's reproducing the voice to the other people's so on the calls here is a sample hey what's up guys welcome back you are watching for tech so it seems very good now i also done the voice calls on the normal and the voip calls and tested for the long duration and they seems working fine now i test a safety net check for this build and it's passing the same as the last build so you can enjoy any banking related security apps without the issue Another bug fix in this build is the external mic. Now you can record the audio also using the external mic. Last time it's recording the weird sound but now it's working fine. Another major change is the encryption. ROM now comes with the encryption by default. So your data is secure now even if your device gets stolen anytime. Even though the ROM is encrypted, TWRP is also working with the encryption. Means we can access the storage in a TWRP now without the flashing the DM warranty means no need to decrypt the ROM. But one issue is there whenever you want to use the TWRP then remove the pins and the password from the security settings. If you keep the pins and the password then the TWRP is not decrypting the password even if you draw the correct pattern or the correct password. Except this bugs fixing and the underwood improvement ROM didn't have any major changes means all the customizations are the same and they are just more refined now. So that is all about the new update, new build is totally matured now and competing with the oldest Android 12 ROM like the Siberia OS and giving the tough fight. 
so it's really worth to upgrade to the awaken os if you really want to change the rom so if i help you please don't forget to like and share this video subscribe our channel press the bell icon for the notification of our upcoming content thanks for watching see you next time take care bye bye